Ryan from B Tech Videos. Just calling to let me know that one of the videos we turned yesterday wasn't one of ours. It doesn't have a label on it, but it seems to be a recording of a guy humping a pillow. The video you should have returned was um, How to Please a Woman in Bed 101 Part 2. Please return it to us soon. Thank you. Congratulations, Mr. Touchdown. Your registration for the 8th UAA rank is now complete. In addition, we have faxed you some information about the rankings in case you wish to continue your ascent. Please transfer the money into the designated account. Have a nice day. Hello and welcome back to No More Heroes. Right, after that little cutscene we get started then. Um, a few things I've done. I did two of the jobs. Uh, the little minigame jobs, and I did some assassination missions and things, powered up through Thunder Ryu, usual bizzo that you just don't want to see. There is One of the jobs is actually quite interesting, um, so I was going to quickly show you that one. Out of the two, one of them's just cack, which was just picking up crap off the floor. It's not very interesting to play, nor to watch, but there's the other one, which is at least reasonably interesting to watch, so I'll show you that one. Right, after that, we've got a new couple of places on the map that's opened up, you can see. There's a bar over there, as symbolised by the pint of beer. Um, other than that, we've also got uh, the t-shirt shop, which I think is now opened up. I'm not sure if that was in before. And the beefhead videos. I don't normally bother going into either of them, because I normally don't give a monkey's how Travis looks. But, um, what we'll do is have a quick nosy in both of them, see what they're like. I do it for you, people. I do it for you. Alright, job centre. Also, the good thing is we can teleport directly to the place, which is nice. Yoink! I'm also pretty loaded at this moment, so I don't really need to do... Don't need to do this at this point, you know, it's just for funsies. And showing you guys, really. Ah, oh, third class man! Yeah, yeah, yeah. Also, this place needs a cobweb clean. Yeesh. Alright, it's the burger sign one. Sign spinning! Okay, this one's pretty fun. So... Well, you'll, you'll kind of see the idea. Like I said, the other one is literally picking up crap off the floor. You just prod it, throw it in the back for three minutes straight. It's really dull. It's also a really crappy way of earning money. Uh, it earns you about 50 to 60k, depending on how quickly you do it. Whereas you can do an assassination mission in like a minute that gives you 70k. Same goes to this lovely side, it must not always stop. And you'll be the one spinning it, you hear? Don't bother thinking about the why. The beauty of labour lies in losing yourself in your work, so get cranking. Alright, on the Wii remote, you kind of just did the... <coughs> the wanking motion, the jerking motion to uh, spin the sign, but on this we get to, I don't know, shake the controller. So you'll probably get to hear my Three. microphone rattle, I apologise. But, One. hey, whatever. Hey, so, let's go. Here we go. You gotta get, you get up to a certain point, and then people start turning up. Come on! Faster! There we go. And you gotta keep it in the red. And you gotta like just try and balance it, but at this point it's pretty easy. So once you got it there, people turn up. And then just try not to let it explode. If it explodes, you well gotta try it all again. You lose Dosh. Come on, buy our lovely burgers! At uh, Burger Suplex. Ignore the man jacking off on the roof, please. If that doesn't put your foot in a nothing one. I love the music for this little bit game thing. Except when it's playing through in the straight and picking up crap on the floor. I managed 20 last time, I'm not sure if I did this any quicker, so I think 20 is probably the limit, but you never know. Ooh, careful. Because it doesn't like speed them up, they just kind of walk, so. 4, 18. I'm pretty sure 20 is the limit then. Yes, that's all you can get then. But look, more turn up! If it only lasts you for like a little bit longer, you get quite a bit of money again. Nevertheless. I earned 30,000. Hooray! Thank god, yay! Ah, oh, my poor wrist! Mm, I'll swig this beer instead. Ah, uh, right. So, speaking of beer, that's where we should probably head next. Although, the video store's right there. Could probably poke our head in there. Why didn't you come from the... Ah, oh, whatever. Travis. Hey man, thanks for bringing my bike. Thanks for doing it really slowly in a cutscene every time. Jerk. Okay. Also, can I see if I've upgraded my stuff? Yeah, you can see my strength and stamina have um, an extra mark on the end there, and the combo says extended now, so it's slightly better than it was. Video, DVD, game, and more. Beefhead. Whoop. Run by Travis's buddy, the guy who just dropped off our, well, bike. 
You pretty much buy wrestling videos here, I think, that give you new moves. Travis, how's business? Travis, it's a bad day to be having a bad day. I mean, check out this death threat email I got on myself. It's from my girlfriend. The word die keeps scrolling on and on. How am I supposed to do business during shit storms like this? My love life, my career, totally worthless. So, videos. Number one. I don't even know what this is. That one? You got it. The title is Mask the Panther, the Tiger's Roar. Whatever. I'll buy it. I got enough money. Peace out, Travis. Keep dreaming. Go away. This is a kind of a neat video store. But, kind of handy on your doorstep. Although, these days, probably, you're probably starting to get kids who don't even recognize VCRs. Maybe not quite just yet, actually, thinking about it, but I don't know. Yeah, I'm just wibbling. Right then! Onwards! We need to go to. What else have we done? The t shirt store. That's right. Then we can pretty much pay the bank. Oh no, no, we got to go to the pub as well! I gotta go to the pub. How could we forget? Whee! This is always terrible, isn't it? Ugh! Oh, turn! Era 51. People have been harping on about to buy some new shirts. I've been finding shirts in like dumpsters, but I'm getting the feeling that they might not be very clean. So, let's see what we can get. It's one of these things that it doesn't change anything at all in the game, so normally I don't bother. I don't really give a monkey's how Travis looks, but. Come on in, brother. Take a good look around. Come on in, brother. Don't judge a book by the cover, okay? This is just my personal style. I managed to stick to his guns, you know? Make a good selection now, bro. Be sure before you purchase, okay? If you don't make up your mind soon, I have to stop you in here, bro. I'm going nuts here. I'm hard on myself and my customers, just the right way to do things, you know? Right. So, jackets are kind of expensive. And they're just different colours. Boo. Sunglasses. How much are sunglasses? Also quite expensive. What else we got? Jeans. Ooh, those are funky. And new belts. I'm feeling a new t-shirt today, actually. Let's, let's look for a new shirt. Warning, radioactive. Tengu. Oh, yeah, let's go with it. Oh, my God, the Moe shirt's expensive. Look at this, the price on the Moe shirts. Miami base. Alright, uh... Okay, let's go with the Gorgon shirt, actually. I like the Gorgon one. Let's do that. Do I get to wear that straight away? Take care now, brother. Another right brother. What? I have no idea what you said. Maybe you should d take the scarf away from your face and might be able to understand you better. Okay, new shirt. Maybe I should buy a new shirt for every set and just no, rock or something. Alright. One last trip before we go on our murdering spree. Ugh, really. I gotta stop parking by those things. Okay, to the bob! Which is the best idea I've heard of all day. Whee! Okay, so there's a mission I did here as well, one of the assassination gigs. It's literally just in here. But we're not here for assassination or murder today, we are here for booze. In particular, a man actually, to do with booze. You shall see. Do excuse me, I shall booze myself. Mm. Delicious. Huh? What do you want? <laughs> Look, man. This is no place for a pussy like you. Go home to mummy. Leave me alone. I want to enjoy this moment. Now, if you had a ball, we may have something to talk about. Find the seven lollipop balls scattered across Santa Destroy and bring them back to this drunk. Hey, you already got a ball, have you? Aha! A ball! In return, let me teach you something. Select the technique you want. Memory of three. Memory of demon, memory of child, woman, mass, tattoo, and white. Uh, interestingly, I believe these are all, um, the killer seven. Become able to perform jump down attack on fallen enemies. Memory of tattoo. Earn bonus based on your rank. It's not bad. Memory of mask, Master Smith. Increases the range of your grab. It's not bad. Memory of woman. Kate, Katie? I can forget. Extends dark side mode time limit. That's pretty cool. Memory of child. Become able to perform dash 
with the X button. T button. Dash seems incredibly useful. Anyway, I'm gonna get I'm probably getting that at some point. Um just let you be run a bit quicker. Become able to perform jumping slash with the R2 and that button. And memory of three displays the position of enemies on the minimap. Oh, that's not terrible. Remember, of child is the dashing one, isn't it? So let's have that. You ready for this? It may tickle just a smidge. That sounds unpleasant. Learn the technique of bizarre. You got that? The technique is yours and yours alone. Come back when you collected some balls. You still have balls? You want to do it again? Oh yes. Uh, is it tattoo that gives you more earn bonuses? Yeah, let's just do that. You ready for this? It may tickle. The little extra things that tend to help out, so if you find the balls, they're always worth doing. Woohoo! Learn the technique of mystery. You got that? Cool. You know, I will get some more balls. Keep practicing. Fun fact, um, I was told this the other day actually, uh, this bar is where Suda himself hangs out IRL apparently, not obviously in the game, but you know, that's what the bar looks like I presume. Seems kind of friendly, except for the drunk that beats people up. So now we can get around, a bit easier. Alrighty, let's pay us to debt. Where are we at? Crap, wrong way. Go to the bank! Woo! And then, if I remember right, we're off to the movies. Alright. Santa Destroy Bank. I think the balls show up on the minimap now as well, which is always handy. But I'll probably forget to do them all. But the dash is the one I always like to get, just simply because it means getting around is less of a bull egg. I've paid the fee, and I've still got enough to pay the next fee, probably. Oh, easily. And especially after I'm done. Woo! Alright. Let's see where we got ahead, and, uh, well, save the game. You know. Come on, Travis. Faster. Ah. Do we get a phone call? Do we see where we're going? What the hell's going on over there? Jeez, don't leave me hanging, honey. Well, that was weird. Luckily, snail mail seems to be pretty quick in this place. I think it just drops through our door. Uh, let's get the toilet. I think as we leave, we get the uh, mail, if I remember right. Or something. It'll come back to me. But more importantly, toilets. Uh. Mm. I made this guy save way too often, he probably should see the doctors. Oh well, details. Oh yes, of course, I forget. It's time for the randomly long saves, isn't it? Huh. <sighs> Maybe I should read the back of the box. Oh wait, I did that. Didn't I do that last time? I need to read a different box. You know, I used to keep an interesting storybook around for times like this, didn't I? Maybe I should read the Cryostasis box. Some sort of weird irony. Want to catch some Z's? I do not. I'll show you what happens when you catch some Z's later on, however. Alrighty, let's uh, hit the town. Hey, mail. I love the poster stamp. Dear Travis, the next ranker is one serious dude. Oh, sorry, one dangerous dude. There's no going home now. You set on the path of the you set the foot on the path of the real man. No amount of tears can wash that choice away. Now hurry to the subway. Get on a train and find him waiting. Put your life on the line. Sounds dangerous. Let's do it. Where's the little kitty? <laughs> Can't go wrong with kitties. Okay, this I said we're off to um, the movies. I think. Frankie Battle Seven is open. Woo. We used this subway a fair few times in the game actually. To move to different places. It's a very efficient city. Alright, uh, you know, I would have appreciated a menu or just teleporting there, but, uh, you know, details, details. Just gotta go the hard way. 
You see all the balls, yeah, all those balls in the minimum, but I'm just not picking up. I'm sure laziness. Luckily, Subway's one of the easiest place to get to, just, just drive straight down. Which is just as well, seeing as later on I'm going to be doing a hell of a lot for the extra missions to get money. Now here comes the real meat of this. Let's do this. Right by Destroy Stadium as well. Destroy man. Come and get some <laughs> Rude. Destroy Man's a good man. He's also got a good name. <laughs> oh, guess we get a ticket. Amazingly the game doesn't charge us for that. Seems like the kind of game it would. But whatever. Oh, I didn't just miss some, uh... Sometimes there's things up there. I bet I missed them as well. Arrgh, I did! Look at that! Bet it won't let me through. Nope. Oh well. My own bloody fault. Whee! I honestly don't remember if we... If we have to fight on the train on this one. We might do. I can't believe I missed that card, that's gonna bug me now. I don't really give a rat's ass about the collectibles, but it's just like, it was there and I missed it. Yeah, we gotta kill our way through the station. Why not, I guess. Alright, dick bags, let's do this. See, I had a burly combo now, and I hit really hard. Alright, jump! Ooh. Oh, between a rock and our place, it? God damn it, the lock on system is a nice computer, so shit. Oop. Yeah, well, you didn't need your spleen anyway. Hmm, guess I was going the wrong way. What up, my man? Is the subway always this dangerous? I like to think not. Maybe sometimes it's peaceful and you can just travel in style. Oh, these are the best. Yes. And slice. My spleen! Everyone has spleens! I feel jealous. I still probably have my spleen, but, you know, I'm not, I'm not really s screaming about it. Maybe they're saying ice cream and I'm just saying it weirdly. Never know, you know, in this game. Peace! Whenever you're ready. There we are. These guys are too cheap for even, uh, you know, ice cream. Ooh! Yeah, you go. And uh, now you've actually got like bigger combos, it makes it much easier to sort of deal with even the guys with the beam swords, which is nice. Which is weird because it makes it ironically makes like the start of the game slightly more difficult than the end of it, which is happens in quite a few games actually. Anyway, that's enough murder on a train for now. We've got places to be. Mind the gap. Or don't, whatever. Ugh. The tension was killing me. I wasn't sure if the doors were going to shut or not. What if they didn't shut? Then what would I do? Occasionally you just wonder if the game's frozen on you. Oh dear. Alright. Now before we leave, there are goodies. <laughs> I wonder if there's actually any up here, or I'm just massively wasting my time. Uh, it's gonna be the former, isn't it? Nope, the latter. Alright, well, we'll go the other way then. Don't mind me. This is why you buy the dash, because it allows you to get around a hell of a lot quicker than you could before. Travis can really run. We. Ugh. 
except when you get stuck on corners. Oh, nah, see? The uh, game's trying to trick me with its flimsy ways, but no, I uh, was ready for it this time. Also, you're happy to murder like 20 people on a subway car, but you're not willing to jump over those. Talk about double standards. Okay, time to part two to the stage. This is a kind of longer bit, I guess. But I suppose it's all irrelevant. Like, no one really plays No More Heroes for these mook sections. Like, no one really cares. It's just... See, we're somewhere nice though, for a change. Bear Hug Film Studio. Hey! Told you I'd take you to the movies. Sort of. Sweet. Sweet. Gentlemen, start your engines. Or your analogies for penis instead of you beam katanas. Yeah, these guys are kind of weird. I'm not entirely sure what they're supposed to do, nor what they're doing, but whatever. Let's just play. I don't pay too much attention to this. I think next time as well we can get a new beam katana. We get a massive one. Unless I could already have got it and I just didn't buy it. Which is also entirely possible because I just didn't check. I'm pretty certain you don't get any one yet. But, you know. Gentlemen. Oh. Oh, yes. Makes life easier when you catch one guy. Oh, nice. Ugh. It's such a weird button combination you have to do for those. I don't understand why they've done it either. It just bugs me. You don't use. It's not the normal buttons you'd actually use. Oh, crap. Guys using guns in this is so irritating. And the best way is just to just sort of ham and take them on. You can catch both of them in one little combo, that's obviously the best, but. They just run away, then shoot you. Later on, you can, like, do, like, long charges and stuff. But whatever. We'll get them now. Okay, this part of the stage isn't too long either. Uh, it's basically just three of these places. Uh, and then we run into the boss, which is nice. Uh, and I'll save the bar for the next one, probably. I can't remember what bar it is. I know avocado was... Well, well, it looks like an avocado or something else, but... Any goodies? A chest? Yeah, might as well look. Yes, my trading cards. I'm gonna do without them. Do 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 do. Cranberry chocolate. Oops. Stuffed it. It's kind of weird. Like the executions on this are like kind of creepy. Showtime. 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 Guess that's that. Oh, getting, getting bummed over us. It's a man with some sort of machete. Not really accepted, isn't it? I'll take it out of, uh, out of order to ask for any more power ups. Whatever! I'm just happy to go on my mass battery spree anyway. I'd be more happy about it if I was. It's stuffy this room! You should see the temperature, it's like a billion degrees, except it's not, and you open the door, and suddenly this cold arctic wind of English summer comes in. Makes you want to question why you're even alive. Because it's kind of chilly. Not in a good way, though, it's just in like a sort of cold, irritating way. Oh, that was nice though. Get some sort of critical combo though. Ooh. Nice. Two more guys in. Both of guns, no doubt. Yes. More than two. Badgers. Alright, we'll start with you, mate. I'm not sure what all the, uh, the basket heads are about. 
but uh, I know better than to question the shirt at this point. The only hope I can get is I get some health and don't die before the end. So yeah, as you can see on the map, we got one more. Oh, where you guys come from? Oh wait, we're not done. One thing I wish that this game had that No More Two Heroes 2 does is that when you perform well in combos, the tiger at the top gets. Well, it's not just the tiger, it's the. Um, oh, nice. Like, uh, the charging battery. They get, like, very active and allows you to do some really crazy combos, which is really nice. Or you can blow it for, like, um, a big old crazy dart side mode. Really, I'm missing one? Okay. Oh, there he is. Why don't you come and attack me like the rest of the guys? Bored or something? Oh, whatever. Yeah, yeah, I know, you're speed. Come on, that's gotta be it. There we go, cool. Again, hoping for some health, but probably not gonna get any. Ah! That looks like health. Cool. I don't need an awful lot, I think just enough to get me through the next room. That's quite handy. No, that didn't go so well. Ooh. Oh man, what's up with these charging guys? The game sure has a capsule on irritating enemies. Again, it's just like, there's a really, one thing I do wish was there's not just a skip and just do the bosses sometimes, because these guys aren't interesting. They just flail around and it's just like, whatever. And because of the way the game sy combat system is, like fighting multiple dudes at once is a bit awkward. Oh, Jesus, speaking of. Oh. Ugh, damn. But again, I don't ever remember the GameCube one being this hard. I don't remember kicking my ass this much. It could be that the, with the motion controls you can do the dodges a bit easier, but you know, just be worse than these days. Alright, I'll save that because I don't think these last guys have been the end of Oh, come on. There's something to be said, like, with Dark Souls, your camera is far enough back you can see all the baddies, which makes fighting multiple guys while irritating not terrible. Whereas in this, you can't see someone from behind, which can make it a bit trickier to actually see what you're doing. Problematic. So I don't believe for a minute this is the last guys. So let's go upstairs now with Gander. A bit low on health there, isn't it? Oh. If it's just you. Cover up. Oh, yeah. 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 Wish I could talk about that combos. I probably can, I'm just gonna come to I really should just blow this spell. I, I don't know, I just got the feeling that gonna be more of them. Whoa! I do like all that. Oh come on, I got this guy. Got him? Can't see anyone else. There we go. Your next ranked battle is at the filming studio. Win, and you'll be seventh. Lose, and you're dropping down to an even deeper circle of hell. So, how are you feeling, Travis? Your head feeling better? Relieved yourself lately? Maintaining proper oral hygiene? 
When you're ready, step inside. Some people say it's important to know when to give up. That you shouldn't aim for things that are obviously beyond your grasp. But ignore idiots like that. Don't accept defeat before the first punch has even been thrown. <laughs> Hello? Anybody home? Did you even hear what I just said? And you call yourself an assassin? This is why third rates like you are hopeless. I am 120% certain you are going to die. All you can do is trust your force and head for the Garden of Madness. Helpful advice as always. Thank you very much. Luckily, we can heal up and everything, which I'm going to do quickly now. Ugh. Well, I took a thorough beating, this one. I really did. Guys with guns are tough, anyway. They drain your battery, they stall you, but load an entire room full of guys with swords and stuff, just like, eek! Ooh, Porter Potty! Porter John. Nice. Let's use it. Ugh. And keeping up the trend, there is also the post to say no more heroes. You know what? At least each place seems to have decent bog roll. You know, the more you can ask them some. That wasn't too bad, I guess, like 19 minutes, was that, roughly, since I saved it and travelled here? Uh, I don't know, I, I just... I find a lot of the normal baddies just kind of irritating to fight. Which is why the missions where there's less of them and there's more interesting stuff going on are a bit better. You know, I'm pretty sure, and I've seen a scene like that in Jackass, where, you know, you've got uh, Johnny Knoxville in the port of Lou before it rockets up in the air or something, God only knows. And he really does look like Johnny Knoxville. Well, let's get a new wrestling move, I suppose. Travis, remember now? The most fundamental among fun fundamental suplexes made famous in Calgary. It's the all-natural all amusement machine, the German suplex. Hooray! I remember an old professional wrestling move. Alright, I've got full health, haven't I? And let's just get full, full battery. And then let's go meet our man for the evening. Take care of some customers that filed complaints. My apologies. So much to do with so little help. Yeah, I can't stand these people with all their nonsense complaints. They think they can just say anything. It's crazy. But anyway, I'm here. I made it on time. That's the important thing, right? I take it you're Mr. Eight? You? You're ranked? Not me. Well, actually, it is me. Oh. That makes sense. Never mind then. You've got a job to do. But first, I need some time to get ready. Would you mind turning the other way? I need some privacy. Privacy? Yes. I need to prepare. Whatever. Don't mind me. Pretend I'm not even here. I just need you to look the other way for a second. A second? Yes, just a split second. I don't think it's too much to ask. Do you? Then we can get on with our fight? That is correct. All right. Oh, damn it. Whoa, that was close. For a second there, I forgot that you were a killer. Sorry if I scared you. I didn't mean to do that. Something's wrong with me today. I let my guard down. But I'm sloppy. I gotta stay on my toes. Do you mind if I ask you something? Yeah, what is it, Mr. Cosplay? We're both assassins, right? Why do we have to kill each other anyway? If you ask me, it's absolutely meaningless. It's about determining who's best. That's what it's about. Can't argue with that. Well then, let's get started. What? You want to shake hands? We're both fighters, aren't we? Not killers, at least for now. This is a sign of sportsmanship, that we respect each other before and after the fight. Good luck. 
Likewise. Destroy Spark. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this is great. Is this guy an idiot or what? <laughs> is this a joke? You fell for the oldest trick in the book. Oh, man, you are something. Oh, this is the best. Man, you really cracked me up. <laughs> I think this laughter's gonna kill me. <laughs> Seriously, I think I might really die from laughter. It hurts. Someone help. <laughs> oh, God. <sighs> oh, oh, shit. I thought I was gonna die there. For real. <laughs> and look at you. You look like you're dead. I guess it's time for a wake-up call. Destroy Destroy beam! This is where it gets good. Good night. Destroy Buster! That was quite a move. I'll admit you've got potential. If Challenge had a taste, you'd be quite delicious. Fight for the seventh? Yeah, sure. Bring it on. I love a challenge. You're as good as dead.